Hello everyone, my name is Lisa. Welcome to my channel. Today I'm continuing on my blind playthrough of Baldur's Gate 3. Last time we went to the swamp and found the note from Kaga and now we are going to go confront her. I'm not sure if that means if there will be a fight. Um, not sure who these shadow druids are. Not sure if the entire grove is populated with shadow druids. Um, really don't know. I do think it's funny as one of these rats is one of the people that we've been seeing uh, described in some of the notes we've been reading. So I'm going to do a save before I talk to her. Ooh, 65. Yikes. What's up with discussion? She would be a little challenging, I think. Go on. Say it. You think I'm a monster? What? Does she know? Oh, she's talking about the kid. <laughs> it's like, how does she know? How does she know what we know? What? Ooh. Ooh. Oh, dear. Oh, dear. She doesn't look healthy. Yeah, what do you think about this dude? That damn nose of yours has gone poking in our business. Mistress Ollerton, I can explain. What the heck is going on? No need. It couldn't be helped. Koga, what is the meaning of this? You think yourself quite the spy, don't you? Go on, tell him. Yeah, Kag is the shadow druid and she means to convert everyone. Though, giving him the letter, you know, he can see his the proof with his own eyes, but I wonder if doing so would open us up for an attack. But it's it's proof. She does say tell him. Maybe we just do the letter. What's in there? Look what. Korga, have you lost your mind? Halsin is weak, Wrath. But in the shadows, we are strong. We are safe. There is no other way. You and Halsin welcome untouchables to your midst. You defile the grove for the sake of harmony. Oladin speaks truth. Who among you disagrees? Who would see this grove in ruin? The choice is made. Koga, burn the tainted away. Start with the snitch. I As you it. say, Oladin. Oh, wow, there's a lot of a lot of options. Uh let's see. can't detect thoughts. Yeah, I'm not joining anyone. <laughs> I like that. Yeah, I like this one. This one's still basically the same possible outcome, but yeah, harmony is not weakness. It's not. Scroll of Charm Person? You can use that in a dialogue? 
Interesting. I mean, this is fairly low, so I'm hopeful that I have a decent chance to win. But that's cool to learn. Huh. Oh, yes. Yay. <laughs> no. You you twist the teachings. In harmony, we perish. In shadow, we are pure. She's Kuga's been voice brainwashed. breaks and her lips tremble. She heard reason in your words. Finally, I pass one of these. I like this just because it looks like I have a better chance of succeeding. I don't necessarily want a huge fight, but I love this about the frescoes because it makes a great point, but I don't know that I'll succeed. So I'm going to say I know these druids ways and everything they touch is decayed. Hopeful. Hopeful. Yes. When? When the darkest hour fell, it was us that brought light. Sylvanus demands we illuminate shadow, not hide Why? within it. Why? Was I so blind? Careful, Korga. The shadows don't forgive. I belong to the shadows no longer. You've no power over me! Or you would question my power. Mother Earth, hear me. Grant me your wrath. Oh dear. Oh, it's a fight. It is a fight. So it's three against all of us? Well, this should hopefully be easy, except for this snare. So just me and... No, just Gale. Okay. So, Asterion. Let me see what she's got going on. Level 5. Wow. I'm really curious to use this eventually. Oh yeah, it would be awesome for her to go off into the water, but then I don't have any chance at her loot, and I don't really want her to go over the edge. So maybe I come over here. Over here. And then I hide as a bonus action. Leave no trace. And then attack with advantage. <laughs> Woo! <laughs> oh my gosh! That was awesome. Not gonna lie, that was pretty sweet. Yeah, I'm very low on abilities right now. You 
picked the wrong fight. Oh wow, that was nice. <laughs> Carlac. <laughs> uh, she cracks Easy. me up. Okay, I guess get her raging. Still trying to figure her out. Still trying to really learn. So that was an action, a bonus action. Okay. I don't need to cleave, but definitely lacerate. Gale. I don't think it's going to take much to hurt him, so. Maybe bone chill? He's kind of hurt, so I'm going to kind of pull him back over here a little bit. <laughs> I'm pretty sure, Starion, that you can just shoot her. No, that's not what I selected. Why, when I go piercing... Okay, why do I have to keep equipping separately? It's weird. Okay, there we go. Missed? Are you flipping kidding me? Wow. Nice. Wrath thought me a danger. Seems I've proven him right. Sylvanus bid me to protect my people from harm. Yet I was the one to inflict it. There was but one druid who guarded the circle, who protected our ways. We are forever in your debt. Is this for us? You burn like fire. You howl like wind. You are Faith Warden. Take our gift and be known. May I not be the last monster you vanquish. Oh, wow. That's powerful. I really like that. Yeah, what does that mean, Faith Warden? When you speak, the circles will listen. Among druids, your words will shine brighter than sun. Uh, yeah, what happens now? I endangered a child. I betrayed the circle's trust. We will stop the right and I will stand trial. My fate lies with Sylvanus. May he have mercy. Okay. Um... I'm liking her a lot now. Anyone who can see their faults, admit to them, and, and you know, own up for it and pay penance, that's, that's how it should be. How did the Shadow Druids even find you? It began with a letter. There was no messenger. It simply appeared. Oladon came soon after. An army was coming, she said. Goblins, drow, and more still. Legions upon legions. The druids of Cloakwood knew the dangers this would bring. They ordained that all circles cast the right to shelter from the storm. Oladin taught me to harness the Tree Father's power to wall us in. In return, well, you know the rest. I would turn the grove over to them. I won't forget the wounds I've inflicted. I pray Halsin returns to heal them in full. And yeah, we need to go get Halsin. Um, yeah, what of the tieflings? We will grant them safe harbor until they depart. Meanwhile, help us contend with the goblins. Perhaps we can dissuade them from attacking. Hail Oak.
Where is that? Yeah. The inventory system still definitely leaves much to be desired. So it's a one-handed weapon. Druidic vines cannot ensnare you and do not count as difficult terrain. Faith Warden's vines. Oh, and it's a quarter staff. Okay, cool. Well, yeah, I'm gonna. Well, wait, is it better? One to eight. Eh, it's on par, but definitely still better. Cool. And it seems like we got some new quests. help them leave, but it doesn't say how. I thought it said two updates. Okay, we need to go tell the tieflings. You hate me. And I don't blame you. I do not hate you. I am ashamed at how far I let your machinations spread. Well, surely there's more for you to talk about. <laughs> Surely. That's still thieving to open Anything stuff. Of use? Darn it. <laughs> like, surely I'm a friend now and it's not stealing to rifle through your stuff. Oladan, yeah, let's see what she has. She was a pretty neat looking character. Basics. Okay. Moving ahead. Well, that was pretty neat. So it said I had a, a title, Faith Warden. Does that show up on your character anywhere? Or it sort of does. Not really. Notable features. Hmm. doesn't look like it. So it's really, oh wait, no, there it is. Tags, Faith Warden. So that's really just another one of those, maybe during dialogue. So it seems like these have only shown up really during dialogue, a different option. Ooh, they did stop the ritual. Please, it's not the time. Sickle. Huh. I wonder how everyone feels about that. Did I look at this? Better not be cursed. Surely I did. By I'm so Sylvanas, nosy. the old oak, all death begets life. Now they're done messing about with rituals, maybe them lot can make themselves useful. Wow. Looks like the druids have eased off some. Small mercies. Well, he's much better. This place ain't so special. Why were the druids so protective of it? Oh my gosh! Kind of the nerve of some people. That's... Wow. It's their home. Of course it's special when it's their home. One day. One day I will find something awesome. What were you thinking? I was trying to help. You nearly died. Did you hear me? Yeah, where is what's his face? Back there. Okay. I wonder how often Gale needs to eat stuff. He's not been complaining or anything. Does he let you know when he needs something more? Oh yeah, I need to go talk to her again, don't I? Why don't I do that before I forget? I don't think I finished talking to her. 
depends. How many people are dumb enough to ask? <laughs> Lee and Roland would never admit it, but they take an arrow for the other. Also stab each other. Not sure what will come first. Thanks for cutting in. There might have been more than words if you hadn't. Oh, was, was something happening? I um, honestly didn't notice. We should have left by now. Damnation! <laughs> Instead, we're just sitting here, practically begging to be attacked. Staying is a mistake. Yeah, why the rush to leave? You don't understand. My apprenticeship with Laroa can begin shortly. I cannot be late. Yes, that Laroacan. The greatest wizard in Baldur's Gate. I've heard that name before. A young man, yes? Lives in Ramazes Tower in the upper city. The very same. Word in Waterdeep has it he's a bit of a cad. But you say he's an accomplished wizard? Of course he is. The greatest spellcaster along the Sword Coast. As if I'd settle for a lesser mentor. In that case, I'd very much appreciate it if you could arrange an introduction, should we reach the city. Interesting. How true would this be? I mean, yeah, it has this Baldurian tag, but how much can we trust that my character actually knows this? That doesn't hurt. Let's see. Common gossip. <laughs> the byproducts of ignorance and jealousy. I've admired Laroacan for years. Never dreamed he'd answer my letter. But I've worked myself to the bone for this. Few can match me in either magic or talent. The names Roland and Laroacan will be known far and wide. You'll see. Interesting. My thunder wave will make quick work of any goblin. Just you wait. Okay, so that makes me wonder if uh, me choosing that kind of maybe screwed something for Gale. Maybe we did want some kind of introduction. Those goblins will rule the day they chose to tangle with this grove. You and I will do some good here. I can feel it. Oh, where is that lady? She was here. Oh, what I do for some salt. Uh, I don't think it was her. It seems like there you was another your lady. Share? Leave some for the rest. Yeah, she just did that. But where's the lady who was here? Huh. That's weird. Wonder why she disappeared. I'm told the druids have stopped their damn chanting. What happened? Truly, Ilmata's ashes. I never thought she would actually see reason. Thank you. We still have the goblins to contend with, but you've given us time to prepare. I need to ensure my people make the most of it. But here, left over from my soldiering days, it's sparse thanks for what you've done for us. And I'm afraid I have more yet to ask. <laughs> Let me guess you want something. <laughs> Uh, tell me what you need. You've bought us some time here, but the goblins are still massing out there. We'd need an army of our own to escort us safely to Baldur's Gate. And while I don't doubt your abilities, you're no army. There may be a way, though. Goblins are ill-disciplined. It's unlike them to organize so cleverly. Somebody must be leading them. Bringing discipline to their ranks. Take out that leadership, and they'll scatter. It's no small thing to ask, but I've seen you fight. You're equal to the task. 
Kill the Goblin Horde's leaders. Sure, why not? Everyone in this camp Hysterian. depends on it. Really? Thank you. We'll be ready to leave as soon as you give word. I would think Asterian would... The flaming fist. Pardon? When we get to Baldur's Gate, where are we in... I would think Asterian would love, um, a fight. Yeah, we already have to go save Halson from the goblins, so we might as well. Okay, I can't remember what it was. I, this, okay. Wow, that would be amazing, especially for Shadowheart. Huh, I think I'll hold on to that for Shadowheart. Looks like Asterion leveled up. Wasn't there someplace near here where I needed to do a jump? And I needed to get Lazel. Seems like there was something yet for me to do. This is a nightmare. I could have sworn there was something yet for me to do. And it was a long jump. I didn't write it down, of course. Okay, so what are these little these little hash marks? Where to go? There we there it is. Okay. See that? It's like a yellow circle with a black center and then this little white mark right there. And there's another one. Shoot, where to go? There's another one on this, but it's pointing up. What do these little things mean? It doesn't say. And like here on the overgrown ruins. Where to go? There it is. Oops. It's, it has that, but it points down, but then this one, the ro roadside cliffs, doesn't have that hatch mark. So what, what is that? I've asked several times, no one's answered it yet. Um, I'm thinking I'll come over here for... Ca uh, for, uh, Carlac. Can I just teleport there now? Oh, I can. Cool. Thought maybe I'd have to be outside. I guess in that cavern I technically was outside. Um, well, geez. Since I am right here, maybe I go ahead and do the windmill. I'm really nervous too, though. I kind of don't want to. <laughs> I don't want to. Maybe I don't. Maybe maybe I'm still scarred. Though it does seem like it was a little difficult to get over here. We'll figure it out. We'll figure it out. It's okay. It'll be fine. Fire wine barrel. Ooh, there's another idea. I could carry this barrel over to the ogres, the three ogres, and like bust it open and cast flames on it and stuff. So it'd be like an AE fire. I'm really wanting to take them out. I wonder if there's anything over here. Rocky crevice. Save. It's been a while since I saved. Not a chance I'll fit in there. Ah oh dear. Not not again with the turning into a cat thing. I don't think I even can.
This will be curious. Who else could get in here? Oh dear. Oh dear. How do I get out of here? Okay, there. That maybe? It almost looks like that should climb you up, but oh my gosh. Is she asleep? Is she dead? Wait, is this the one? Is this the one I was in earlier? Or is this a different one? It looks, it looks like the same one. Right? Yeah, there's the chest. It is. She's dead? Why is she dead? Why is she dead? I didn't kill her. I killed the goblins that were in here. I'm a little nervous to be in here all by myself. <laughs> that was funny. I'm upset that the owlbear is dead. And that really makes me nervous because it's like, who else is in here? That doesn't look familiar. Where's the baby? What the heck? So, there's stuff going on in the world even outside of... what my actions are. Oh, wow. Jeez. Yeah, what the heck? How come, how come there's like goblins in here and they killed her? There weren't any goblins nearby. I killed the ones. No, or was that a different cave? I'm thinking maybe that was a different cave. This really upsets me. I was expecting to come back and um, help her. Head of a broken spear. They poked her eye out. Oh my gosh. And where's the baby? I'm so upset. More for me. Can we hatch this egg? It's camp supplies. Oh my gosh. 750 gold? Are you kidding me? Surely we don't eat it. I'm certainly not going to sell it. Ugh, I'm so upset. I am so upset. I, I am so upset. I didn't want her to be dead. I was going to come back and help her and heal her. Am I encumbered? Survival check. I am definitely encumbered. Can I just send stuff to people even when I'm separated like this? I wonder. I can. That's so funny. Yeah, 
Yeah, so what was the... Maybe there's a trap. And someone did say that you should be able to accomplish opening this. Apparently, it's something over here. Oh, hello. Light and dark. So, do we need to, like, move it into the dark? And then it will open. Maybe. Just looking to see if there's anything over here for me to pick up. I don't see anything. Ah, <laughs> oh, dang it. So, I don't think I have anything that I don't think I have anything that um, casts any kind of darkness I'm trying to think of like what Gale has Era of darkness. Maybe. Uh. Nope. <laughs> that didn't work. And yet it's not radiating. So frustrating. Yeah, I don't know. I wasted my one arrow of darkness. I can't move it. Doesn't work. Um, dark and alluring. Nope. I don't know. I don't know. I don't see anything in my environment to use. Like, yeah, I read that book and it gave me an idea, but... I can't move the chest into the dark. I have... I threw darkness around it and that didn't help. So, I still don't know what to do. thinking maybe I could fill it with water because this water looks awful dark 
thinking maybe the water is something. It's dark water, because even in the sunlight, it looks pretty dark. I don't know. I'm grasping at straws. I am literally grasping at straws. So you can't, like, fill it up. Yeah, it's nothing I can interact with. I don't know. I guess I'm stupid. I I don't know. I can't figure this out. I don't have anything. The arrow of darkness should have worked. I can't move it. There's nothing else in my environment to help. And I can't scroll back enough to see where the opening is to see if I can block it somehow. There's nothing I can shoot down to block the light. I don't know. I must be stupid. I'm still really, really upset about this owl bear. Just looking to see if there's anything else here. I don't see anything. I can still get through. Maybe I should. No, this is good. Not a chance I'll fit in there. Darn it. Okay, now I have definitely have to rest because I don't think I can do much else, especially if we're about to go into a fight with those people. Uh, y'all gonna follow me? Hello, let's go. One day I'll catch a break. And there's that guy's corpse again. I still do not remember finding mail. I mean, maybe I did, but I don't remember it. Wizard of Waterdeep. What? What's that? Gale, maybe? Oh, so it does pop up when you need to give him something. Okay, cool. Oh, okay, see? Yeah, Arcane Hunger. Okay. Yeah, it was ripe with magic. Oh my god, stop it, people. Yeah, get your ass up there, Gail. You. Get up there, too. You. Get up there, too. Jump across again. There, too. Oh, yeah, I do need to level up the Starion. Okay. What's so funny? You haven't got some laughing curse, have you? <laughs> I really made it out of Avernus. It's incredible. All right, just keep it down. I'm conspicuous enough without your hyena call. Hey, <laughs> let's talk to Carlac. Hey, we're still going after those paladins, right? Yes. Can't leave Zariel's bruisers roaming the coast. Yes, we're definitely going after them. Good news. 
can't wait to see him finished. Okay, what do we have for Gale? What do we have for Gale? Actually, why don't we just talk to him first? My condition is worsening again. I need to consume some powerful magic or it may become volatile. He needs it way too often. Oh, I don't remember getting this. Huh. Color spray. What was that again? Hmm. Not terribly impressive. Yeah, he is a very needy dude. I don't think I've used this. Maybe this. I don't know that this would be used very much. I'm kind of regretting uh, destroying that hat because it had healing. Though this color spray is not terribly impressive. You needy you. little bitch. Yeah, that's how I feel too. Experience. Each time anew, I come. Lost soul is spelunking through the darkness that is me, only to be sacrificed on the dread altar of the heart. Somehow the second artifact hasn't had the effect of the first. Oh no. Somewhat relieved the discomfort, but I fear my hunger hasn't quite. Ah. <laughs> yeah, no kidding. Tell me we didn't just waste a piece of magical equipment. Ever the pragmatist in chief, aren't you? <clears throat> the magic isn't having the effect it should have. It's not like the last time, like a rainstorm that quells a forest fire and merely drizzles. The embers still sizzle, the fire remains undefeated. He wants more and more. What's going on, but nothing good. Please. Rare stuff, doesn't he? I need to retrace my steps to a glade of calm and think. Thank you for the artifact. A great deal of trouble it was, too. A great deal of trouble, indeed. Yikes. Uh... Okay, let's go. Let's keep going. I'm not sure how I feel about going into a fight at this point. Don't know how many people we might be coming up against, because Lace is all out of juice. Full desire. Gail's doing pretty good, though. Hey, ho. Well, hello. Let's level up Asterion. That would probably help. Maybe we'd lead off with Asterion. Though if there's talking that's going to happen, I don't know about that. Wow. Okay. Spells. <laughs> the thing we just destroyed. What is the purpose of disguised self? What good does that do? I'm thinking, like, if you're scouting with him and you can 
I mean, his charisma sucks, but if, like, I don't know what kind of appearance you can take on, but, like, let's say he could go in by himself, disguised somehow, if it works, like, as a goblin, and, you know, rescue someone incognito, so to speak. I'm, I'm wondering if that works. I'm gonna take that. I'm really curious. Wait, what does this mean? It's all the same. What is this? What is this indicating? Choose a feat from this list. Wow, this is this is a lot to go through. I think I'll go with Dungeon Delger, Delver. Any advantage to perception checks I think is awesome. Okay, so let's have him go first. Over here. Dead Toll Collector? Toll Collector? <laughs> yeah, I'll take the money. I need it more than he does. Uh, let's save before we go up this. I'm hoping it's okay to come this way. Oh dear. Hide. It's Cyril, a traitor. I don't want to pickpocket her, but let's go talk to her maybe. Keep that beast away from us, you hear? Me, the beast. Uh-oh. Now that's fucking rich. Uh-oh. Oh, okay, so... I, I came here expecting an immediate fight, but that... Ew, intestines. A severed head. Dead knoll. So it's all about what's in here, huh? I thought we could surprise some people if we uh, got up here to go inside. Let's go oh, this way first, though. Oh, did someone come out? Okay, so they're not hostile yet. That's good. Let's investigate these corpses. Someone eviscerated those knolls. It's rather beautiful. Of course, Asterion would love that. Nothing here. I saw... A... I don't suppose you have any clue where we are in relation to Waterdeep. From this distance between Elthorel and Baldur's Gate, I'd say a long way away. <laughs> ah, that will make getting word to my mother rather tricky. Empty. Yeah, I swear there was a book. Where is this book? There it is.
Why would why would a rib cage be flagging as an object you can open? Like I saw a yeah, rib cage. You can open a rib that. cage. What is there a heart inside? That is so weird. Opening rib cages. Uh-oh. Yeah, I heard a door open. It sounded like a door opened. I hope you don't need a severed head for anything. Cut it out. It's worse than those out there. Nothing we need to worry about. I'm watching very carefully. I'm I'm kind of like just waiting for someone to pop out. It's quite odd for there to be all of this just right here. me up about these rib cages. A severed arm that you can pick up. What am I gonna do? Throw it at someone? Aha. Something over there. I knew there had to be something. Please that don't tell is tiny and I am not. Oh my gosh. Don't tell me. That Lisa needs to go in there. Can she become a mouse? Stayed interesting. No, I didn't think she could. That doesn't look. Let's put it on the map. Oh, okay, it's on there. Good. Yeah, she's not gonna be able to fit down there until she takes a long rest. I was thinking he could come up this wall, but I don't think he can. Okay, let's go all the way around. Oh my god, they went peace. inside. Why did no they go more. inside? Leave us in peace and we shall leave you in kind. Oh my gosh. Cut the crap, Anders. I know what you are. Don't let her hurt us. Please. We just want to go home. Yeah, let's try that. Let's try that. How come I can't get a bonus from Asterion and his necklace? Oh, sh snap. Nothing in his demeanor betrays him. <sighs> um, can I? Oh, character select. You can change your character. Uh, can I... can't open my inventory. Dang it. Yeah, you'll need to convince me. I'll tell you whatever you wish to know. Just let us live, please. Oh, uh, this is rich. They serve the archdevil, Zario. Biggest liar in all the realms. Seems her servants have picked up some of Mummy's tricks. Believe me, these sneaky fucks won't stop till they have me hogtied at her feet. It isn't true. Half of us are badly injured, the other half dead. I admit we ambushed you. An assignment from our god, Tyr. We thought you a devil, and with your flames you proved us right. But Tyr will not consign us to our death. He is merciful. Leave us, and we'll leave you. Um, I 
I don't know what to do. I don't want to upset Carlac. I don't know. I don't know. Um, let's go with number one. Enough. Enough. I'll not play pretend anymore. Ah, good. Good, Carlac, good. You're going home in pieces of needs must. And you. You'll soon learn what it means to ally yourself with the likes of this garbage. The furnace was never my home. It was my prison. I'm free now. And I'm never going back! Oh dear. Asterion. Oh my gosh. Asterion, dude. Uh... Is she part of the fight? No. I don't know what to do. Is she one of them? She is, isn't she? Maybe he could take her out by himself? Again? No, but we can do, we cannot do a bonus action. And there's those in there. We'll not get far. But jumping away, yeah, that will cause an attack. That's funny. I would think jumping away, they wouldn't have opportunity against you, but... Oh, she missed. Good. Well, keep going, dude. On the way. Time to push my luck again. What is this little thing above his head? Hunter's Mark Quarry. Ah. And why am I suddenly hurting so much? Is he wearing metal? It looks like he's wearing metal. Didn't I have something? That helped with that. <laughs> Thought I did. Okay, yeah, she needs to take the potion and come over here. Bye forever, pal. Let's see, Carlac, what can you do? It's worth a shot. Haha. <laughs> Darn it. And let's have her come over here. One can't always be a gentleman. Ooh, Gail's really hurting. Okay, so she has concentration. this though. 60% better than nothing. Dang it. 
Erg. Let's go around the corner. I guess in turn. Ah, dang it. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. I think I may have to reload. This is really bad. So it's going to take both of my turns to get anyone up. would be more helpful to get up. Gail, I think. Together. Of wits. Potion. Oh shoot, he can't hold. Oh, because he stood up, so he's just gonna get hurt again and again, isn't he? He's just gonna die over and over. Yep. Jesus. Yeah, I think it's time to reload. There's no way I'm succeeding in this. There's no way I'm succeeding in that. And you know, looking at the time, it's, it's really way past time when I should have stopped, so... I think I'm going to have to leave it there and we'll come back to this fight in my next episode. So I'm really sorry. Um, I, I guess I just let it go a little over long and I totally bumbled everything about that. I did not expect Asterion to run through the building and start the encounter. I was expecting to do it a bit differently in my head. So we'll pick up here next time. Thank you everyone for watching. See you then. Thank you everyone for watching. If you enjoyed my video, please subscribe. It really helps the channel. If you'd like to help me to continue producing new content, consider supporting me on Patreon. The link is in the description below.